it was never fancy or spectacular. It never won the Mans. It was never awarded a Nobel Prize. It didn't write The Grapes of Wrath. It was just your mate, someone you enjoyed going to the pub with. This is my 2001 Ford Mondeo ST200 V6 2.5 litre. Back in 2001, iTunes was launched. Wikipedia was launched. George Bush became the president. If you're a single mother with two children, which is the toughest job in America as far as I'm concerned, and you're working hard to put food on your family. Foot and mouth outbreak. Game Boy Advance was released. Tony Blair won the second general election. The Bradford riots. 3,000 people died in September 11th terrorist attacks. War in Afghanistan. The anthrax letter attacks. Microsoft XP was released. The iPod was released. The Xbox was released. That's fascinating. <laughs> this is an X-Reg SD200. It has just over 122,000 miles. It has a few scuffs. Paintwork isn't perfect. The seats have a few scratches. The wheels need freshening up. But the good thing is, it's nice and original. It's nice and standard. It's not been molested. Doesn't have horrible body kit. Doesn't have 20 inch rims doesn't have a massive spoiler stuck to the back of it doesn't have horrible aftermarket lights hasn't been slammed to the ground but what it, what it does have and what it can do is this Do you get these cool tractors? You gotta stop when you see a Ford. Look at this. Ah, the LED light bars. These are freaking cool, no? Look at this thing. Holy shit. This thing's freaking massive. Whoa. Size of V8, baby. What's this used for? It's fucking cool. I love it. Got some more stuff around here. Look at this. Another Ford. Steiger. St Steiger. Badass. Oh, look at this. Look at this. All these wheels. TW25. So fucking cool. This way, let's go, let's go. Murphy, come on. Slow to McLean's. Plato got the run. He didn't have to hit him, but he did. 
Well, that's really made a mess of the pack as well because Tarquini and Christensen have now cleared off. Plato's lost a lot of momentum in that move. You can see the gap. Alain Menu, our race leader, moving up on K and Lemmer, the leading Class B cars into Redgate. In the late 90s, James Gandolfini starred as Tony Soprano in what is probably the best television show ever made. So she's trying to buy some municipal bonds or stock options or something because she's worried if something happens to Tony, what's she gonna do? She doesn't wanna she doesn't wanna work, she doesn't wanna get a job. So anyway, she's on the internet uh, researching these different stock options and her son walks downstairs. He's got his phone in his hand and he says to his mum, Are you still on the internet? And she says, Yeah, I am as a matter of fact. And it, it took a moment for me to click, but I was thinking, yeah, that's right. You couldn't, you couldn't use the phone while somebody else was on the internet. It wasn't so long ago that somebody was teeing off right there. But when they built this motorway, the golfers left. And that's what happens. Things change, things move on. You see, we live in a very disposable culture. We're told every three years you've got to trade in your car for the next one. I have to get the latest model. Maybe I don't want to move on. There's no way I could do without heated seats. Maybe I just want to sit in my Mondeo and annoy the neighbours by doing this. What's the plan for the Mondeo, you ask? Bluefin, bluefin, super chips, super chips, super, super, super chips. New clutch. Yeah. Front discs, upgraded brake kit. These are bigger. Uh, new calipers to fit the new discs. New starter motor. Starter motor is but noisy, so new clutch, new starter motor at the same time. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, what is that? Brake pads, maybe, or something. Some new lights, side indicators, new HD, HD LED lights. These are probably not even allowed, so I don't even know if I can fit these, but. LED headlights. Petronas, Formula One, Mercedes sponsor, so obviously good enough for uh, Mr. Mondeo. Um, five litres of that, I don't know if that's enough, I might need more. By the way, top tip, when you're changing the oil in a Ford Mondeo, um, you should always remove the old oil first so you just drain out the old oil first uh, before you put in the new oil that way there'll be room in the engine for the new oil to go I've already put in a new fuel uh, an air filter from um, not k &M, but something similar uh, new foam one demon tweaks or something ah, I don't remember it's a good one though. It was quite. It was like uh, fifty quid or something. So plans to polish it up with some compound, and then you know see how well that goes. Um, because yeah, I don't really want to have to get a full respray, but I will. I will do it for for the for the Mondale. Um So yeah, seats also. Seats. I'm gonna try and. Do a little bit of repairs um so i've been watching some tutorials on that um and the whole car inside and outside needs a good valet anyway but it stinks of cigarettes so yeah i want to just get into that carpet and really just smoke the fuck out of that smell um but yeah that's the plan uh probably priority is the new clutch because it's quite high at the moment don't want that going. Um, we'll check the 
slave and master cylinders while doing that check there's no leak etc and um, starter motor which is quite noisy um, I need to order a new brake light and a new um, fog light as well and uh, yeah install this because I'm excited to see how much improvement this makes in terms of the power I put this on the Focus ST a similar one to this and the Focus ST is turbocharged um, you're always going to get more benefit or gains with the turbocharged engine when you're doing stuff like this um, and yeah noticed a big difference not just with like power um, but with fuel economy as well um, really did make a big power improvement to the focus that we have so um, yeah got one of these I think it was about 350 pounds this so it's not cheap but good thing about it is you can put it on and take it off as much as you want um, you can just do it here in your own, your own driveway so uh, yeah that's it for I guess that's it for this video um, so catch you all later